Blood 21. Three years. A lot of things have happened in this three years. <clears throat> Every day, moving from town to town repeatedly, when, when moving, we avoided the proper path and advanced the trackless path. Master who becomes drunk when reaching a town every day. There is no day that I rested physically and mentally. Why are we not using the highway? I have the rough expectation to the answer in these three years. It's because Master hates grown humans. In order to not meet with people, we pass through the place where people don't come. Although her expression doesn't change, I understand somehow that she will be in a bad mood if the crowd of people by the atmosphere. In the crowd of people. Otherwise, I don't think that she would use magic to deceive her own appearance. Master came to conceal her appearance by magic before I know it. Because I, who, who was always uh, with her, noticed that too late, I don't know when she used the magic. The effect of the magic makes Master to only be recognized as white. As long as a person with good intuition doesn't observe her carefully, it seems that the only impression of white comes out. Only the impression. So, even if she passed by the people in town, they will only think, she's white. And the face, face details and the impression annexed to it don't come out. Thanks to the effect, it didn't become the situation like before using the magic. The people past her will stare at her fixedly, but they lose their interest in her immediately after glancing her. Because I've already recognized Master from the beginning, this magic doesn't seem to have an effect on me. Master hates humans to the extent to use such a magic. She tends to avoid the contact with the humans as much as possible. The exception is Aerosan and me. Although Marizophis is better compared with the others, I feel that his treatment is slightly rougher than us. Or perhaps I should say, ignoring half of his existence. Well, we who are made to advance the steep path because such a prick picky individual are not endured one are not the endured ones, but the stamina and skill rose by advancing the steep path. She might have aimed this a little. I understood that Master is trying to train me to become strong in these three years. I think that I have strengthened considerably in these three years. I think is because I have not experienced a combat yet, and it's only the date seen objectively from the skills and status. The monsters hardly approached because of Ariel-san's intimidation, and because we advance the trackless path off from the highway, we hardly encounter bandits. And even if we do encounter one, Master or Ariel-san will deal with it immediately. Although I have the awareness that I have become strong in these three years, still, the vision of winning Master and Ariel-san doesn't come to mind. Those two are strangely strong to that extent. Master is a sacred beast, and Ariel-san is a demon king. The fact that there is no lie in the, in the words was clearly shown. I think that I don't accept the fact somewhere in my heart, but the power of the two of them was a real thing. I can't help but to accept it. Even if I appraise them, their strength is unknown. Master is impossible, impossible to appraise, and Ariel-san is appraisal was obstructed. Oh, okay. So, Shiro, uh, you can't appraise her because she's a god, and Ariel is intentionally blocking appraisal every time. I developed a skill level of the appraisal to 9 in these 3 years. It's a result of penance that was the always activate the appraisal to raise the skill level was leaked to when Master is drunk. When Master gets drunk, she gives advice occasionally and talks about her own past. Although most of the stories are not useful, among that there are advice that are really useful. Appraisal is also one of it, and Master said that her life had been saved by the appraisal so many times. So I always tried to activate the appraisal, as Master says. Although I thought my head was going to break, I was attacked by a terrible headache, and in the end, I can't activate the appraisal all the time. Maybe it's because I persist to do it so many times, to do it many times until the very limit. I acquired the Divinity Area Expansion skill newly, but at that time, I was on the verge of fainting, so I don't have the time for that. Because I continued such penance, I can raise it to level 9 in a sort of short period of 3 years. Although I hear that Master raised the appraisal to level 10 without taking as much as 1 year, it can't be as a reference because the standard is strange. I must hear only half of the story of Master's past stories and advice. It's not that Master is telling a lie in particular, but half of it can't become a reference because it's too non-standard. Something like bathing, bathing la the lava to raise the fire resistance, and raising the skill level by activating it always. Although Master says, try and do it, lightly, the only one who can do it is Master. The place named the Elro Great Labyrinth seemed to be a considerable demon boundary. As long as I don't even do the absurd master's level of raising usually, I can't survive. I don't know how many times I heard the words, I thought I was going to die, when she's drunk. She might have really experienced the feelings to die that much. When thinking from there, I think I'm blessed. I can stay alive is because of master, and although I had to do many unreasonable things, I was able to become fairly strong. I must express my gratitude for that point. But, but, I want her to stop eating my body whenever she's drunk. Why must I perform a life or death struggle st staking my body every evening? Moreover, I'm defeated in every struggles. Moreover, moreover, when the morning comes, that has been forgotten completely. Why must I spend my time in a dangerous night in the town rather than the outside where alcohol can't be drank? Isn't it strange? 
Ah, uh, seriously. If there's no such thing, I can express my gratitude, honestly. Although the lost part can be restored by recovery magic, the fear and the pain when I minced won't disappear. Even though she only licked me at first, it gradually became play-biting. Then, the biting strengthened and became stronger little by little. Finally, the flesh came to be taken. Why did it become like this? Recently, whenever she drinks alcohol, somewhere of me will definitely be eaten in the end. And if ariel San didn't put up a barrier, the inn would probably be destroyed by the fierce battle repeated every evening. I wonder if this can be called as combat. I'm still level 1, though. Although we continue the travel with such feelings, we finally enter the demon's territory. I will follow Master on Ariel-san, even though I said this and that, and I decided to enter the demon's territory. Yes, I stopped thinking about the small conclusion like the humans or the demons, because I don't know there's an impossible to understand an unreasonable existence with my own body in this world. I've come this far after this and that, so I will get on in the demon's territory. I feel like that. Yay! Road trip ends! Aww. <laughs> I mean, we're still gonna get more of uh, her interacting with uh, Shiro, probably. But, uh, yeah. So they skipped, they skipped forward three years. <laughs> I mean, I think we already knew that it was going to be three years, but I, I jokingly said that it would take, like, we would see all the three years. But we get, we get a little summary. Um, you know, what, what, what's really going to happen on the road? Nothing, nothing can happen on the road. They're not going to meet new fun people because she's fucking avoiding all of the people. <laughs>